Welcome to EduCounting, where my dad is passionate about financial education. Today's video is on your piggy bank. We all have a piggy bank. It holds our money for allowance, babysitting, and special occasions like birthday parties and holidays. As I save money, it goes in. When I want to buy something, it comes out. It got too full with dollars and coins that it was time to move it to a real bank. A real bank works the same way. If you put money in, you can take money out. It's safer too because if anyone steals it, the government will repay it. That's called insurance. When something bad happens, like a car wreck damage to your house, insurance pays for the damage. Anyway, my parents and brother won't borrow money from my piggy bank either. Did you know a piggy bank comes from the word pig? That's a type of clay used in pots to hold money. Cool, huh? A bank sometimes charges you to hold and protect your money. Other times, a bank gives you money called interest. That's crazy. Every month, I get an email that shows how much my account is. It's called a statement. When I put money in, it goes up. And when I take some out, it goes down. A bank account makes it easy to pay for things. It also makes it easy to put money in for my work, like my allowance. I have it all in one place. My parents use their bank account in the same way. When they get money, it goes in, and when they pay for something, it goes out. They say it makes things really easy. Well, thanks for being here, where it's fun to talk about money and learn things at Edge Accounting, where my dad is passionate about financial education. Bye!